was another video of Corbelly Christchurch once again which is the route to the airport and it was the original route to the airport prior to the construction of the ABC highway this was the road everyone had to use to get to the airport but long before there was any ABC highway this road can best be referred to as the old airport road Corvally or some people refer to it as Charnox but Charnox is the village just behind the airport further up we were looking towards the airport now the Grantley Adams airport our airport is the only port of entry by air it can be referred to as BGI, GIA or Grantley Adams International Airport the airport moved to its present location in October of 1976 after it relocated from Sewell which is just behind here and moved to its present location this was the road everyone had to use to get to the airport prior to the construction of the ABC highway the ABC highway only started construction in the mid 80s and was completed by 1989 it was the plan of Barbados second prime minister Tom Adams who wanted the highway to be built for motorists to have easy access to industrial estates across the island instead of having to go on the long haul route we created the ABC highway Tom Adams created the ABC highway for motorists to have easy access to industrial estates across the island you can see the generators for the Barbados Island Power Company so this is the road I believe back to Oystings on the south coast of Barbados this was the road everyone had to use to get to the airport prior to the construction of the ABC highway sadly Tom Adams the one who invented the ABC highway he did not live to see it completed he died four years before the completion of the ABC highway but the highway was the plan of Tom Adams who was Barbados' second Prime Minister running from the airport in the south to the University of the West Indies KFA campus to the east to the, to the west to the highway starts from the south to west So the ABC Highway is the fastest route to the airport, more so than the South Coast route, more so than this route. The, the ABC Highway will get you to the airport much faster. Most people that use this route will be traveling along the South Coast, which should be a lot of traffic. When you get from Oystings, are probably going on to St. Lawrence Gap with all the hotels and restaurants and tourists which called on the narrow road is what causes it to be so much delayed around the corner from here you'll come across the Farm and Garden Express which is owned by the Barbados Agricultural Management Development Corporation which was once referred as Charmeters the East Tower's Grown Provision it was at the Farmer Fairy Valley Plantation House 
and you can see a bit of the south coast from here with Long Beach and Chancery Lane and Silver Sands and you can see the runway for the airport from here as well so I'm in the parish of Christchurch which is the southernmost parish here on the island and this bus shelter is also sponsored by the Barbados National Oil Company as well and again we are looking up towards the well that was opened up a few weeks ago due to some accident Now the well is open up. You have to be careful that nobody falls in it. Again, the, uh, the, the generous for the Barbers Aiden Power Company, and you can see the control tower for the airport as yes, well. So Corvally, Christchurch, Barbados. So this road will lead you to Oystings, Tomberry Hill, Pilgrim Road, Providence, and back to the south coast of the island. And again, Oysters is Barbados' fourth town and largest town as well. And it's situated on the south coast of Barbados in the parish of Christchurch. You can see a bit of the runway from up here as well. A bit of the runway we can see from here. But mostly you have to view the runway. You can get a good view of the runway and the planes taking off and landing from behind. Behind the fair in the fair valley area. Here would not be a good place. It's best to go in the fairy valley area.
So thank you guys for watching now and have a blessed evening.